ones sure are adorable. What? You don't believe me? Look at this one, and this one, and this one, and- <laughs> Dear Lord, was that Nicki Minaj? Actually, that's a- that's a jinx. Is it based off Nicki Minaj? Yeah, pretty much. Wow, seeing that hideous piece of garbage has really opened my eyes up. Some Pokemon are actually ugly as all hell. There is bound to be tens, if not hundreds, of Pokemon that are all, well... Drop dead hideous. Basically, yeah. So, I'm gonna be counting down the top 5 ugliest Pokemon. But, in all honesty, I'm gonna need some help with this one. Who should I grab for the collab? Pick me! Damn, I have absolutely no idea who to pick. Please pick me! Well, guess I'll go solo. Pick me! Oh, I got it! Ah, uh, finally. Maybe if I ask PewDiePie, ah. he'll wanna- Me, I can do the goddamn video with you! Wow, no need to shout. But we're gonna have the one and only Play Rough help us count down these disgusting pocket monsters. Thanks for having me, Luke. And to everyone watching, remember this video is based off of our opinions, so don't take offense if we say, for instance, Stunfisk is ugly and you just think Stunfisk is the most adorable thing you've ever seen. This is just how we feel. Exactly. Now, I'm sure we've kept you all waiting long enough, so let's jump right into it. You suck. Yeah, well, you swallow. Shots fired! Well, you look like a Swalot. That's right, at the number 5 spot, we have Swalot. Look at this thing. Does this look appealing to anyone? It is an ugly, bland purple color. And let me ask this. Why does Swalot always look like it's about to go in for the kiss? Like, I will never get my virgin lips within a three mile distance of this ugly blob. I sure feel bad for all the dittos that ever have to breed with this. This next Pokemon takes a turn butt face to a whole new level. Yes, of course, I'm talking about Skuntank. This thing literally has an ass for a face. And the fact that it's a skunk is even worse. Skunks are known for their ability to spray liquid stuff from their backside, but something tells me that Skuntank does it from the front. It is now completely clear to me why this thing is a poison type. Skuntank is actually notoriously known for being an incredibly good rapper. You know, cause it spits venom? No? Oh. Okay. When a Pokemon has a word in its name, it can only be associated with that word. For instance, you wouldn't expect Onyx to be a plant, but you would expect a whale or, despite being spelled differently, to be a whale. So why does Perugly have the word ugly in its name? Game Freak had the intentions to make this Pokemon as ugly as it can be. And man, I gotta hand it to them. Look at other cat Pokemon, like Persian, Delcaddy, Purloin. They all look like your average feline, but Perugly has a much less appealing design that designates it as one of the ugliest Pokemon out there. We all have our own taste of what exactly is attractive. People have different preferences. For example, some might like brown hair, while others fancy blonde. This is just one of many examples of how beauty is opinionated, and that everyone is attractive to at least one person. Well, almost everyone. I mean, I'm not trying to be harsh, but please tell me where the beauty is in a giant pile of garbage. That's right, the runner-up for the ugliest Pokemon goes to Garbodor. This thing is just a compilation of garbage. Game Freak even went to the extra mile and made it so that Garbodor has no symmetry at all. I can't be the only person bothered by this. As I said before, we all have our own opinions, but Garbodor's ugliness is a fact. <laughs> Ah, so we finally made it to the number one spot, and I'm sure it comes to no one as a surprise that the ugliest Pokemon is... Granbull. Hold on one second, my good man. How can you tell me that my mascot is ugly when yours is a Squirtle? Okay, some people probably consider Squirtle to be one of the most adorable Pokemon out there, but even if you don't, you can't say that it comes close to any of the other Pokemon on this list. Well, I happen to think that Gramble is quite a sexy gentleman and should not be considered the ugliest at all. Well, you have to remember, this is all based off of opinion in the first place. Well, why don't we put all this opinion nonsense aside and base the number one ugliest Pokemon off of pure facts? Where will we find facts about an ugly Pokemon? Well, the answer is quite simple. The Pokédex. Many Pokédex comment on how shabby the appearance of Feebas is, and the Heart Gold and Soul Silver entries even go as far as saying that it is the shabbiest Pokemon of all. 
thus deeming Feebas the number one ugliest Pokemon. Well, damn, can't argue with the Pokedex. And since it's actually in the Pokedex, you know what that means. What? The people that leave hate on opinionated videos and are closed-minded can't disagree with it. Yay! And that's gonna be the video, guys. Huge shout out to PlayRough for agreeing to collab with me. Thanks for having me, Luke. Anytime. And to all you viewers, make sure you subscribe to PlayRough's channel via the annotations or the links in the description for another awesome and upcoming PokeTuber. Bless. Thanks for all the support lately, and as always, let the outro roll!